AC Milan vs Atlanta BC prediction, team news, lineups preview. After suffering back-to-back -back defeats, AC Milan face a tough test of their fading title credentials on Sunday evening. When inform Atlanta BC arrive at San Siro. Milan may lead their Lombardy rivals by seven points in the Serie A standings, but the visitors have just won five league games on the spin to start narrowing the gap. Match Preview Despite going down 3-2 on the night, Milan finished the job of progressing past the Europa League playoffs on Thursday evening, having taken a three-goal lead to Rennes after cruising to victory in the first leg of their knockout tie. As at San Siro, Rafael Leo was on the scoresheet in France, where Benjamin Bourjaud's hat-trick consigned the Rossoneri to a second straight defeat, nonetheless, a 5-3 aggregate victory saw them progress to the last 16 of UEFA's second-tier competition. Where Czech side Slavia Prague will await. While Milan have already posted at least 52 points at this stage of a Serie A campaign for the third time in four seasons, as many as in the previous 16, their faint Scudetto hopes took perhaps a fatal blow last weekend. When Stefano Pioli's much-changed team suffered a setback in nearby Monza. Now enjoying his best form since moving to the club last summer, Luka Jovic blotted his record by being sent off for violent conduct in a helter-skelter 4-2 defeat which saw the home side score twice in the closing stages to beat their regional rivals for the very first time. Though still within two points of second-placed Juventus, the Rossoneri's oldest foes Inter Milan are a further nine points clear at the top. And having been eliminated from the Coppa Italia by Sunday's opponents, the Europa League is surely their last chance of claiming a trophy this season. Not only are Milan aiming to keep their visitors at bay this weekend, maintaining or even improving their seven-point buffer in the process, but they will also wish to avoid losing both Serie A matches to Atlanta for the first time in 16 years. Atlanta have won only three of their last nine league meetings with Milan, but the Bergamo side were 3-2 winners in December's reverse when Ademola Lukman struck twice while Toon Koopminers bagged a decisive brace in the club's recent Coppa Italia encounter. Booking La DEA's place in the Cup semi-finals that should provide a psychological edge for John Piero Gasparini's men, who secured a sixth successive victory last week, beating opponents battling for Serie A survival. Having swept Sassuolo aside, with Cup Miners among the scorers in a 3-0 win, Atlanta now face a crucial run of fixtures in the weeks ahead, after tackling Milan, they must meet Inter next Wednesday. While fellow top-four contenders Bologna will then visit at the start of March. Over the past five match days, the Nerazzurri lead the way in terms of points 15, goals scored 17. Plus goals conceded too, and despite Lukman's prolonged absence they have still scored as many times as in the previous 11 league games. Locked in a tussle to claim Serie A's fourth Champions League spot albeit Italy could yet earn a fifth. Should they join Milan and others in progressing to the latter stages of this term's European competitions, Atlanta are enjoying a real purple patch, but tougher tests lie ahead. Friday's draw pitted Gasparini's side, who did not need to participate in the playoffs by virtue of topping their group against Sporting CP in the Europa League's last 16, and the first leg of that tie will follow three major domestic tests. Team News after making six changes for last week's loss to Monza, Stefano Pioli should name a full-strength 11 to take on Atlanta, despite the exertions of a midweek trip to Brittany. Milan's head coach has been boosted by the returns of Pierre Cagliolu, Fikeo Tomori and captain Davide Calabria to full training, and while the latter could even start on Sunday, the others have been absent for far longer and may just make the bench. As Luka Jovic must serve a suspension for his costly dismissal last time out in the league, Olivier Giroud's place up front is entirely uncontested. The French forward has 12 Serie A strikes to his name this season and is just one short of matching his best total in Italy's top flight. Meanwhile, Milan-owned Charles de Cadillaire has made a scintillating start to 2024 and the Belgian will aim to grow his tallies of six goals and six assists since arriving at Atlanta on loan. Another of La DEA's attacking threats, Toon Koopminers,
has scored seven of his nine goals away from home this term and could now reach double figures for the second consecutive campaign. Already this season, the Dutch midfielder has been directly involved in three from two games against Milan. The visitors may also have a Demola Lookman back in their fearsome front line. Following his journey to the Africa Nations Cup final with Nigeria, though he is still struggling with an ankle problem and could join injured defender Jose Luis Palomino on the sidelines. AC Milan possible starting lineup. Minin, Calabria, Gabia, Jair, Hernandez, Adley, Reinders, Pulisic, Loftus-Cheek, Leo, Giroud. Atlanta BC possible starting lineup. Karnasecki, Scalvini, Jimcidi, Kolasinac, Holm, Darun, Ederson, Ruggieri, Kupminers, Mirinchuk, De Ketelaire. We say, AC Milan 2-2 Atlanta BC. Atlanta 10 and Milan 12 are the only two Serie A sides to have scored at least 10 goals via substitutes this season. So late inspiration could well come from the bench in a close-fought contest. The points may be split at the final whistle, which would maintain the Rossoneri's grip on third spot. Thanks for your watching, don't forget to click the subscribed button and hit the bell icon for more.